seemed to get it. The, the little cripple boy was a boy who couldn't keep up when the, when the Pied Piper came to take the children away. I know See, that. It's, it's, a, it's a twist. I know it's a twist. It, it's the children he was after in the first place. The children who was after? It's the children the Pied Piper was after. <laughs> My idea was he brought the rats. He, he brought the rats. He knew that the townspeople couldn't pay. It, it, was, it was the children he wanted in the first place. This reminds me. What? This reminds you. How does that remind you of anything? It's in the box. I believe it is. What's he doing to him? Oh, something, <laughs> something fucking really horrible. But, you, but I don't know, do I? You said you wouldn't touch him. I haven't touched him. But you said be fine. You gave me your word. Katurin, I'm a high-ranking police officer in a totalitarian fucking dictatorship. What makes you think you can take my word for anything? <laughs> what have you done to my brother? What have you done to my brother, I said? You hear that, Ariel? Now Katurian's asking all the questions. First it was opens in the box. And that was why you were torturing the spastic. And now it's, what have you done to my brother? Fuck what's in the box! What have you done to my brother? See, Ariel had a troubled childhood. <laughs> Tends to take it out on the retards that we bring into custody. It's pretty bad, really, when you think about it. I want to see him. No. You being such an upstart and shouting all over the place, I usually would have smashed your face in by now. But since I've just been doing that to your spastic brother, my hand really hurts. <laughs> so for now, I'm just going to let you off with a very stern warning. Ah, uh, you smashed his face in, did you, Ariel? Mm. Ah, now that could be considered police brutality. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, he really hurt my hand. Oh, look at your poor hand. Oh, I know, it really hurts. How many times have I have to tell you to use a truncheon or a what do you call it? You use your bare hands, Ariel? On a spastic? You won't even get the benefits. It's just a child! So what happened to the third child? The third child. You know, I'm taking a breather. But the next time I go in there, I think I'm going to put something sharp up inside him and then turn it. Oh, you know, Ariel, that would definitely be considered police brutality. <laughs> I want to see him right now. <clears throat> what happened to the third child? Third child! So, it's just you and your brother, yeah? You're close, you and your brother? He's all I got. You and your spastic brother. It's not a fucking spastic! The writer and the spastic brother. It's a good story, Katorian. He's just a child! No, he's not. You know who was? Andrea Javokovic was. You know who she was? Only from the papers. Only from the papers. What do you know about her from the papers? She was the girl that they found on the heath. The girl they found on the heath. Do you know how she died? No. Why don't you know how she died? The papers didn't. The papers didn't say. The papers didn't say. Do you know who Aaron Goldberg was? From the papers? Only from the papers. They found them in the dump next to the Jewish corner. Do you know how he died? No! The papers didn't say. The papers didn't say a lot of things. The papers didn't say anything about a third child, a little mute girl. Disappeared about three days ago, same age, same location. The papers will be saying something tonight. The papers will be saying something tonight. The papers will be saying a lot of things tonight. About the, about the mute girl? About the mute girl. About confessions. About executions. Wait, what are you trying to say to me? You saying I shouldn't write stories with child killings? Because in the real world there are child killings? He wants us to think that he thinks that all we've got against him is a fucking disagreement with his fucking pro style. Like, we don't know what his brother just said to me. What did my brother just say to you? Like, we don't know what's in this box. Whatever he said to you, you made him say it. He doesn't speak to strangers. He spoke to me? He speaks to strangers, all right. He said that you and he speak to strangers. I want to see him. You want to see him? I want to see him. That's what I just said. You are demanding to see him? I would like to see him, okay? You are demanding to see your brother. I'm fucking demanding. Yes, I want to see he's all right. He will never be all right. 
I've got a right to see my brother. You've got no rights. Sit down, please. Not no more, you ain't got no rights. You're right, everyone's got rights. You ain't, or why ain't I? Open the box. What? <laughs> I'll give you your fucking rights. Yeah, like I bet you gave my brother his rights. Open the box. I gave him his rights, all right. Yeah, I bet you did. I bet you fucking did. No, I bet I fucking did. I don't open the fucking box. Open the fucking box. <laughs> What are they? What are they? You know what they are! They were found in your house! No! Your brother's already admitted his part! No! But he's hardly the brains behind the operation! You know how the little girl on the heat died? Two razor blades out of little fucking throws wrapped in apple, funnily enough! You know how the little Jew boy died? One of his toes, second toe, his third toe, the fourth, and his fifth toe! And the little Jew boys five fucking toes and they were found in your eyes! I just, I just tried to stop them! They make a nice final fucking twist, make don't they? Make them swallow them! Where's the mute girl? Where's the mute girl? What are you doing? You said make him swallow them! I was just scare them, they're evidence! Have some sense! <laughs> Fuck off! Have some sense! Don't start on me again! And quit with that problem childhood shit too! Well, you did have a problem childhood. Quit it, I said! Look at your hand, it's so obviously fake blood! Oh, fuck off! Pardon me. I said, fuck off! So fucking moody. <laughs> I have no idea it was gonna go right there. Scene.